most embarrassing part. It's our food. It's lactate. <laughs> How do you know if you're a YouTuber? Hey guys, welcome back to Our Family Nest. So today, Carly and I are gonna be doing a video sharing what is in our purses. I think it's been a long time since either one of us has it's filmed. probably since like I've even had a purse. Yeah. Like I actually used one. I think too. maybe you filmed it before and you faked it because you never really carried a purse until now. She actually carries a purse. Obviously, there's um, a bit of a contrast well, here. Yours is way too big. Well, the thing is, is I don't necessarily take this with me everywhere I go. It just depends. I actually have this inside that's kind of like the stuff I have to have. So we'll get into that though. So to get started, where is your purse from? This purse is actually from Princess Polly. And tomorrow I actually have a new purse coming in that I got from Michael Kors. So her first big girl purchase. What? No, it's not. I literally bought a car. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> these awesome. kind of, what are these purses called? Because these are like super in style. Like, they're just like mini purses, I guess. They're, they gotta be called something. I don't really know, but I have a few of these. Alright, my purse, I've had this for probably a couple months now, maybe. It's from the sack. It's really soft leather. It's probably the second purse that I've ordered from there and the first one that I ordered from there the stitching actually came apart so I'm like I'm gonna give it this one more shot before maybe I just never order from them again <laughs> and then like I said I have this which is kind of like a crossbody I don't know some might call this a purse some might call it a wallet but like if I'm just running in the grocery store or something like that I would just take this with me First, before we get started on the contents of our purse, which I feel like mine might take a little bit longer than Carly's, I'll have to go fast. We wanted to share with you guys today the sponsor of today's video, which is Journey Band. We both have these little kind of like, mine almost looks like a watch. Hers is kind of more of like a rectangular shape, but here's the cool thing about it. See these little dots here on the side? This actually opens up. Mine's on the side. Yep. And when you squeeze it, hand sanitizer comes out. See that? Watch how you can really do it is open it like this, squirt it. So it's, so it's like, like on your hand. hand. Yeah, yeah, so then you're kind of. So Carly has the original Jeremy band on. This is the Jeremy 2. And we actually have a bunch of them here in front of us. They have pretty much whatever your favorite color is purple, orange, brown, whatever they're gonna have. Um, of the Journey 2, we got a gray one, actually two gray ones, a white one. Um, of the original one, we have this brighter pink, we have a green and black, we have another black one like Carly's, because I figured the guys would like to have the black ones. So I'm gonna show you how this works. So whatever kind of bottle of hand sanitizer that you have, the easiest way to fill these is to put your hand sanitizer in this little bottle that comes along with the uh, Jeremy bands. Okay, so then you're gonna close this up and then this cap just slides off the top. All right, so then you're gonna take the tip, insert it into the hole there, and then squeeze some of the hand sanitizer into the band. Then you're gonna set that off to the side. You could obviously throw this in your purse and then close that. I'm gonna put it on. The reason I like the Jeremy BM 2s is it's actually like adjustable. So then when you wanna use it, open it up, give it a little squeeze till the hand sanitizer comes out. You can even just let it drip sort of down on your hand. And then, there we go. So I feel like these would be perfect to send onto your kids for school. And it doesn't matter what age, littler kids, younger kids, like a second grader, they're gonna think this is the coolest invention ever. And then someone more like Carly's age for high school, obviously it serves more of a purpose than just something that a little kid's gonna think, ooh, they're gonna show it off to everybody in their classroom. But it's just gonna be really convenient for when you're using the bathroom or just going from classroom to classroom. If you're, you don't wanna have to like dig through your purse to find your hand sanitizer, you can just walk through the halls having it here right on your wrist. So when you purchase them too, the other thing is uh, right on the back it says, thank you so much for your purchase. For every $5 we make, we donate a dollar. So they are helping families and communities and schools through COVID-19. 
And then both of the original Jeremy Van and the Jeremy Van 2 come with these little instructional cards showing you how to fill them, how to use them. And then here's just a little card that shows out the different colors that they have available. You can follow Jeremy Band on Facebook, on Instagram. We will put all those links down in the description. And today you can use that code FREENEST to get free shipping on your order of Jeremy Bands. But I really think they're affordable. They'll be a great peace of mind for parents, for their kids to wear these. And like I said, they're for adults too. They're adjustable, so anyone can wear them, and it's just super convenient. So the reason I like this is this little thing opens here, and you can put your phone in. Even my phone, which, um, where is my phone? My phone even has the loopy case on it, and you can still get it in here. Like, there's enough room. So that's kind of nice. And then it opens up, and this is just the basic wallet stuff. Driver's license, money card, I have a Kroger receipt in here, I have some cash, I have here in the zipper part, this would probably be the only thing interesting. This is my car key. I don't even have like normal keys. This is just my car key. So I don't really have a wallet in my purse. I just kind of have like a card holder thing. It's from Kate Spade. In the front I have my license and I have my school ID. And then in the back, I just have a few like store cards. Like I have one to Forever 21, Lululemon and Hollister. I just- Gift cards? I said store cards. I know, are they gift cards? Yeah, oh. gift cards. Oh yeah, you need to use those. Yeah, I just forget and they're really <laughs> hard to get out. All right, next, let's see. This is probably, how do you know if you're a YouTuber? <laughs> like one of those TikToks. How do you know you're a YouTuber without saying you're a YouTuber? You carry a tripod and a camera in your purse. And this one, this one is even like, janky. all of our G7X cameras are all falling apart. They need to come out with a new one so we can buy a couple new ones. Also, not that I can show you this, but I keep my debit card in a different spot because- Easy access? Yeah. yeah. And it's, I can't get anything out of there, so. All right, next up, I have a loose mask just floating around in there. And then I also have this bag that has some more I keep them masks. in my car, not in my... Like, what is this time period we live in? Like, whoever thought we would be carrying face masks around in our purse, you know? Next up, I have um, some lactate. <laughs> <laughs> you know they make cute little pill holders. Well, I don't have one of those. We need oh, to one get of them you. Broke. We need to get you one tomorrow on our shopping trip. Mm. I'm gonna add that to my list. So yeah, basically it's just a bag of black <laughs> That's so random. Let's see what's in here. I was looking for any pills that I might have. I have Advil. I have the um, little key code thingy to visit my grandmother in her assisted living facility. And I have not used this for a year because we're not allowed to go there right now. Um, I have a little perfume, a chapstick, and a Revlon lipstick. Oh, and a pad of paper. <laughs> so cute. So, and this little bag is from Lululemon. Super cute. I have uh, paint samples from Carly's room. I probably don't need those on there anymore. And some Eltoys. See, half the stuff I keep in my purse. Oh, drawer. this is why my purse is so heavy. Look how heavy that is. Holy it's cow. Good. I need to take it's this okay. out of my purse. This is a uh, USB okay. charger thing for when your phone dies and you're out. Somewhere. You know what? What good does this do me to have this in my purse? I don't even have a charger in my purse. Okay, I next. I have a charger in my purse. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, oh, that's pretty funny. Oh, I do have keys. I forgot I have this. This is the key to my mom's house, and our P.O. Box keys, and our house key, which I never use because I go through the garage. Next, I have my keys. Oh, this is cute. Yeah. It's like, I used to just carry this around. It used to have like a little card thing on it and I kept everything in there, but then I was like, no, this is kind of weird. I have a purse. Yeah, so it's basically just this cheetah strap thing from Amazon. These are from Amazon. They're like basically just these little rubber bands that connect and a crystal. Cool. Yay, nice. All right. I have, whoops, sorry. I have a pair of glasses. 
And these are, I don't know what they are. They're from that one place. I think for Glasses USA. These are just my going to the movie theater, which we haven't done in a year, and Carly's dance competitions. These are Hillary Duff. Oh, okay. These are the only time I wear these once in my purse. No, they have, are USA. I have a pair in my car and a pair in the bedroom that sometimes I watch TV with them in the bedroom, but I don't have to wear them. Like, my prescription's not that strong. Next up, my newest addition is pepper spray. I'm not really sure what this part is, but it was on there, so I just connected it. But I tried pressing it, it doesn't really do anything. I never sprayed pepper spray before, so one time I was like, oh, I'm gonna see what this is like. And I sprayed it in our old house, and it sprayed out like orange That's everywhere. That's what it is, you didn't know that. No. <laughs> so don't test it in my office. Take it outside and test it. Alright, I have my, um, no. I have my AirPod Pros. Is that what these are called? What do, what do we call these? We call them AirPods. That's what Dad calls them because he doesn't know what they're called. I'm ignore those ones. Okay. And then I just have some random little hair ties. That's about it. Oh, I do have a charger. It's a really short one. This is all I have left. It's me and my. Cow. Holy cow, girl. Hold on. 120, 40, 50, 55, 60, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 17, 74. Okay. I know you would know. Alright. All I really have left are pens, garbage, that's old garbage. You messed it all up. I um, keep it in order. This was a bracelet for something. Dance competition, maybe? Yeah, that's what that is. Another pen. Another pen. A DSW receipt. DCB. He wants up here so bad. Another pen. Oh, this one is and so this is the embarrassing part. What? I don't know if I should show them the most embarrassing part. Is there food? <laughs> bars in my purse. Who am I? I don't even, I mean, I like little bears, but I don't love them. I can't remember what I put these in here for. Maybe your dance competition. Because it was like, sometimes we, she never wants to eat before a dance competition because she doesn't want to like, you know, have a full belly when she's dancing. So I get hungry. I bet you that's what I put them in here for. So. All right, guys, hopefully you enjoyed our video. Be sure you guys go to germyband.com to get yourself a bracelet so you're prepared next time you're out in public with some hand sanitizer. Make sure you're subscribed, give this video a thumbs up, and take advantage of our code down in the description below so you can get free shipping on your order. So thanks, guys. We'll see you in the next one. Bye. Bye.